Hello scholars! In a previous topic, we talked about time zones in the United States. This topic, word problems, time zones in the world, is a continuation of that, but specifically dealing with how time zones occur across the entire world. If you have yet to go through that topic, please go back and go through that topic before continuing through this topic. So just as a recap, time zones exist because we need to have differences in time to account for different places on the Earth. So, what does this mean for working with around the world, time zones around the world? Well, first we need to know that time zone differences, in general, stay the same. If there's a five hour difference between New York and London, there will always be a five hour difference between New York and London, no matter what the starting time we're talking about. So how do we figure that out? Well, there's this handy dandy equation I like to use that basically says that the current time here plus the time zone difference is equal to the time there. For example, if it is 5 o'clock in New York and it is 10 o'clock in London, put New York and London, we can figure out the time zone difference by using this equation. It must be 5 hours, because 5 plus 5 equals 10. That means the time zone difference is always 5 hours. Which means, if I'm thinking about, hmm, it is 2 o'clock here in New York, I can add 5 hours to that, and I can figure out what time it is in London. F 2 plus 5 is 7. So it would be 7 o'clock in London. Remember, the time di zone differences should always stay the same. I hope that was clear, and good luck.